So I've just been into Bin Q to pick up my paint and materials for next week. First time I've used uh, b and Q. Uh, quite nice having a trade entrance to go into. Um, makes you feel very special. Uh, and I decided to pick up some laminated wood, uh, which I'm going to paint with. I'm going to paint it uh, half with fire and ball paint, half with bal spa paint. Um, I'm going to let it dry uh, only for today. Uh, so we'll see which one hardens quicker. I'm going to get my kids to uh, stick some yogurt on it, some jam, uh, mustard, tomato sauce, barbecue sauce, brown sauce. Uh, and then we're going to clean it off and see what the scrubbability is like on them and if they leave a stain afterwards, which they shouldn't do. Um, and then I'm going to hit it. I'm going to hit them. I'm going to hit them with all sorts of hammers. Spoons, knives, forks, scrape tests, uh, and we'll see how they fur up to a day of demolition uh, after just being painted in well this morning. So we'll see how that goes. Okay, so paint's finished. Four coats, four top coats. Here we have Valspar, wood satin, fire and ball, modern eggshell. Hello? Yeah. yeah. There it is. I need to destroy it. So it's been in the demolition lab and the kids have actually done a really nice job. It looks like a nice picture you could put on the wall. It's got a tea bag. Barbecue sauce, tomato sauce, tomato puree, mustard, barbecue sauce, and coffee. All spread on it. And now I'm going to wipe it all off and see which one looks the best. The fast fire and ball. Have to rewrite these names on. A little bit tough to get out. Do do do. So we have the moon. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, pass by 700, just to perfectly. No stains left in there. Brown ball, my dog shell. That was perfect as well. You can still see the bit of yellow in the bottom corner here. Off the mustard. So, so next we're going to um, draw on it with biro, pencil and felt tip and hit it with various kitchen utensils and see which one wins. What do you want? I've got some more bits for you to demolish. Side. 
one pound. Okay, so this piece has been in the demolition lab with the kids, and you've got crayon, red crayon, black crayon, biro, and felt tip. So after about half an hour of scrubbing, I've got all the barrel out. There's a slime mark there, you can still see. Fire and board definitely came off the worst there, it's just because it's a lighter colour. The Valspar 700 wood satin held up really well. Fire and board modern actually held up really well, scrubbed them both. Um, yeah. Fast part V700 wood satin finish wins. So, after all the test done in the demolition lab, uh, Valspar V700 wins, which is good because that's what we use. And uh, and yeah, only took like only gave them an hour uh, to dry, so it's not like they fully cured. Um, so, it's not like uh, the best test, but it's a really good test uh, to show what you can do to it uh, within an hour or two. Um, yeah, cool. I'll probably do a video where I leave a piece for a week and then I'll do the same tests and we'll do a comparison then. But uh, as far as this test goes, uh, V700 Valspar wins.